Hello everybody, we're here today to show you how to set up your K4000 welcome kit. The demo kit comes in two cases. The first contains your K4000 brewer, the second contains all your accessories that you need to do the demo. Let's start with the accessory kit. The kit contains the tablecloth, K-cup pods, powder, and everything you will need to do a demo. It also contains labels you will use to ship the brewer back. First I will open the accessory kit to remove the tablecloth and put it on the table. Now let's open the brewer box. The brewer weighs approximately 40 pounds and you'll want assistance in setting the brewer on the table. Flowjet pump hookup. Take the flowjet pump out of its box and lay out the components. Connect the wand line to the in valve. There is a small mechanism that pushes up and down to lock the line in place. Insert the wand into your jug of water. Plug in the blue power connector into the top outlet on the flowjet pump where it says switch. Put the small clear tubing piece around one end of the long thin white tube and push it in the out end of the flowjet pump. Push as much as you can go then pull out slightly to ensure it is catching and stays put. Depending on the demo kit you receive, this may have already been completed. Ensure the flow jet is off. Plug one end of the black power cord into the wall. Plug the other end into the bottom of the flow jet pump below the blue insert piece. Ensure the flow jet is working by placing the end of the water line into the water jug. Turn on the flow jet until water flows out the end. Now turn off the flow jet and connect the end into the brewer. Push in as much as you can go, then pull out slightly to ensure a solid connection. Fill the milk powder hoppers. Open the lid on the front of the K4000. To fill the powder hoppers, you will need to remove them. Adjust the clear plastic spouts in front of the hoppers to a horizontal position. To remove each hopper, gently push the front face back and then tilt up a quarter inch to unclip from the holder. Slide the hopper towards you to disengage and remove. Do this for both hoppers. Each hopper holds one one pound bag of powdered milk. Do not overfill. Once the hoppers have been filled, place them back inside the machine. Turn the spout back to their original position where the long ends are pointing down into the mixing bowl. Be sure that the bottom of the mixing bowl is locked before closing the lid on the machine. Run a test brew without a K-cup pod. Turn on the brewer by pressing the power switch on the back of the brewer. The brewer will heat up for approximately 45 seconds before it is ready to brew. Wait until your beverage options are visible on the screen. Place a mug on the drip tray. Do not insert a K-cup pod. Lift and lower the metal handle. Select coffee and an eight ounce to start a brew. Hot water will flow into your mug. Time to run a test cappuccino brew with a K-cup pod. Brewing a cappuccino or a latte, place a mug on the drip tray, lift the handle, select a K-cup pod, and place the pod in sideways. Select coffee, select cappuccino or latte, select brew size, and wait until beverage brewing is complete. Give a taste to make sure everything is good to go. Break down after the demo. It's very important to follow these steps. Remove and empty the powdered hoppers. Empty the K-cup pod bin. Then turn off the flow jet. Disconnect the flow jet line from the brewer by pushing on the gray collar, pulling the line out. Take out the large white probe from the five gallon water jug. Put the end of the flow jet tubing into the water and run it so that all the water drains out of the flow jet tubing. Then turn off the flow jet. For the brewer, run the hydraulic circuit drain to empty the brewer. Turn off the brewer and disconnect it from its power. Pack up all the accessories and apply your labels. Work with your contacts at the demo location. Thank you very much for watching this video. We are convinced this will lead to more successful demos and a better understanding on how the machine works. Please do not hesitate to contact.